it is flipping humid today guys um we've got cloud cover all day but it's meant to be raining now um but the past few days it's been saying it's going to rain and then it's just like been spitting for about five minutes so i don't believe that um <clears throat> We've got a delivery coming today of some materials to build um, new shelters and new a new paddock for the donkey, the new uh, donkey and prince as well. So we're going to be doing that today. Just taking it slow though because it is so humid. Um, but yeah, everything's good. Um, Mufasa at the moment he's having treatment for ulcers. Um, so I'm gonna tell you a little bit more about that in a moment. But um, yeah, just busy. It's a bit frustrating this time of year because it's so hot and you sort of get the bare minimum of the jobs done and then it's just too hot to work. So even though we've got cloud cover today, it's gonna to reach a high of 36. Um, and that along with the humidity it's going to be very unpleasant so um but prince is coming to the sanctuary tomorrow which is very exciting um so it just means that we've got to crack on and get prepared um but yeah all good at least it's not blazing hot sun so we can work in it Mufasa has gastric ulcers. Um, when he first came to us, he had them and he was treated for them, but it seems like they've come back again. Um, so basically he has been laying down a lot during feed time and not properly um, digesting or ingesting his food. So he's been chewing it and then spitting it out. And these are uh, signs of ulcers. Sorry, I'm just going to interrupt Rachel there for a second. Please remember to like and subscribe to this, this YouTube channel and like this video. Thanks. Back to Rachel. Gastric ulcers in horses um, can be caused by a number of factors. Um, one of the most common is due to improper feeding. So horses should eat for 16 to 18 hours per day. Um, when they can eat for this length of uh, time, the stomach acid um, causes the ulcers, so they need to be eating to neutralize that stomach acid. Ulcers can also be caused by stress, and we think the reason that he has these recurring ulcers is due to his Cushing's disease. Um, basically, it just means his immune system is compromised, so he's more prone to get them. So we've got him on this, which is omiprazole. Uh, we've mixed it into yogurt so we can get it into his mouth um, just to make sure he's getting all of it and we've noticed we've had him on it for about um i think a week a week and a half and we've already noticed a massive difference in him <clears throat> but ulcers are often a reason for that a horse can't gain weight because he's just um chewing that food and spitting it out because he doesn't have enough saliva to be able to digest it so we're hoping after this treatment and along with the Cushing's treatment which he started that he'll start to gain a bit more weight <clears throat> he's definitely already feeling a lot better in himself and um, eating a lot better um, he's not got any discomfort anymore so yeah I think we're just gonna um, do the treatment and then keep it on keep him on the treatment as a preventative measure at a lower dose uh, just until hello Daisy <laughs> Yeah, at least until the <clears throat> Cushing's medication starts to work. Cute. Open. <laughs> Oh. 
So now he's got to wait 30 minutes just to allow the omeprazole to start to absorb into his system and then he'll get his breakfast. Is that good? Or is it horrible? <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.